Sir Jim Ratcliffe is close to becoming a minority shareholder in Manchester United, after his main competitor for the club, Sheikh Jassim bin Hamad Al Thani, withdrew from the takeover battle. Ratcliffe, a British billionaire and the founder of Ineos Chemicals Group, is a lifelong United fan who has also invested in several other sports teams and projects. He is set to pay £1.3 billion for a 25% stake in United, according to Sky Sports. Sheikh Jassim, a Qatari businessman and the brother of the Emir of Qatar, had hoped to buy 100% of United, with a £5 billion bid through his 9-2 foundation. However, he became frustrated with the lack of progress and ended his interest in recent days, as reported by multiple outlets. The Glazer family, who have owned United since 2005, announced last November that they were exploring strategic alternatives for the club, including taking on external investment or selling the club entirely. They have faced protests and criticism from many United fans over their debt lot and ownership and lack of success on the pitch. Ratcliffe's deal would see the Glazers retain majority control of United, with 69% of the shares. However, it would also give Ratcliffe some influence over the club's affairs and potentially inject some fresh funds into the club. Ratcliffe's bit is expected to be finalized this week after a board meeting. It remains to be seen how United fans will react to his arrival and whether it will have any impact on the club's performance and ambition. United are currently struggling in the Premier League, sitting in 10th place after eight games. They have also lost their first two games in the Champions League group stage and face a tough run of fixtures after the international break.